All right, we're going to set up a navigation controller for iOS, but only do it with, we're doing it without this template. We're just going to have what we want because the template, the initial views a list, and uh, it's confusing if you don't know what you're doing. So hit window-based app, hit next, and just put it in a name, uh, nav test. All right, next. Good. And we have our app. First thing we want to do is go into our main window.xiv. We'll open our um, library here. And we want the navigation controller. Just take and drag it out as a separate thing. And that's all we need right now. Uh, so now that we have that, let's go back into our navtest.h file and we need a new property and it will be an IB outlet of UI navigation controller. We'll just call this nav controller. Right? And now we need to synthesize this in our .m file. So right under here. We'll change that. Okay, so now let's hook up this to our um, delegate here. So just tag and hold down control and uh, actually the full view. We better just do it in this. So in our thing, just say um, our reference outlet here and it's the uh, navigation controller just drag it out to that All right. so now that we have that hooked up let's do some styling in this navigation controller header you can just type in the name of your app so we'll just say nav test enter um, if we go here where it says back button, just type in back or else it'll use the name, the titles that you set for the uh, header. And let's save that. Now let's go back into our .m file and in this did finish launching with options before the self dot window. Let's do um, self dot window dot nav uh, root view controller equals self dot nav controller which is our property that we just hooked up okay and after we do that let's just hit save and now let's make us another view so that we can call it so right click new file we want UI view controller next save that we want with an XIB interface uh, we'll just call this um, main view and in main view let's open our nib we'll just have a button we'll call this next let's add a IB action to it so we can do some view changing Um, change view All right and then let's code this in alright so now we need to hook this up so let's drag this out to change view and we need one more view to change to so new file, exact same thing. Second view. Okay, and in this second view, we're just going to have a label. Alright, so we know we changed to it. Okay, so to make main view be shown, we have to go into our main window XIB, into our 
view navigation controller here and we click on view and over in our uh, attributes we need to set the nib name so this is main view All right. if you hit enter you'll see that change and then over here under class we just call this main view it has to match the nib and the class name All right. so that will get us showing the initial view and now how to switch switch from our main view to another view we go into our main view header and let's add our import statement for our second view because we have to call it and then in implementation in our change view let's uh, create a new object for our second view Alright, and we'll have to lock and init this, and then we can say things like second view dot title, and we can set the title num two. All right, and let's go ahead and release this and before that to actually change the view we just call self dot navigation controller and then we want to push view and then what view are we pushing second view animated yes and that's all we have to do to switch views so let's go ahead and build and run and this will pop up our initial view will be our main view with the uh, next button we hit next and it goes to our second view second view you can see our back button is back if we click it we go back to our main one so that's how you set up it set it up without the template and messing around with that list and deleting all that stuff so hope you better understand how it works